first of all, Aaron, God, that must have been pretty emotional walking out the off course like last day. And how are you feeling after that one? Yeah, it was, um, it was pretty special. Um, but it was also very heated and, uh, yeah, the first sort of 60 minutes was um, good old Bledisloe. Um, very tough and um, Australia were pretty awesome for a lot of that game. And, um, you know, I had a different role in the team this week, which was to finish the game and just wanted to get on there and do my job. And um, to uh, end up on top was, was brilliant and um, to dig ourselves out of a bit of a hole was cool. Um, we've got to take some learnings from that, but um, massively proud of the effort. You had to go two two tries down pretty early, um, and then stay in it and um, have a good reset at halftime. And that was probably the saving of the game: is getting our messages, getting our game in check, and um, trying to you know implement those because we had to make some shifts. Is that the key lesson, like being able to dig yourself out of a hole and win a test match? Well, it's not how you want to always be, but it's nice to see that it's in there and. Um, you know, tonight we wanted to take another step forward and um, it took 78 minutes, but we took another step. But there's also a lot of learnings in there. And, you know, massively proud of all the new boys that got a run and debuted and really stood up. Um, and, you know, just to be a part of a test like that under the roof in the afternoon was pretty special, but, um, you know, there's a lot of learnings in there for us. It was pretty ugly in, in times. But sometimes it, that's the ones you remember more, the ones when you do enough to win, and um, tonight was that. Did you think you were almost going to get the dream finish there when you made that break down the down the left hand side? Probably for about two seconds, <laughs> and then uh, the woman caught me in two strides and thought I'd better step in. And uh, yeah, but it was, it was pretty cool. Um, the whole week's been great, and yeah, it was just good to get a um, you know another chance to wear the black jersey, and then the meaning of playing at the stadium, um, a place where you know, I played a lot. And you know, running on and hearing the people cheer is pretty special. And something that'll stick with me forever. And I'm a blessed man, and um, owe a lot to the city and the stadium. Has it, has it been an emotional week for you, given you know last test at home, where it is? Has it been that kind of added layer of emotion for you? Oh, I think my role was different this week, so I don't want to get too up for it and too over the top. Um, and also, when you had those feelings, it's trying to acknowledge it, but stay focused on the task at hand. And for me, that game was um, in the balance when I came on, so didn't want to overplay, didn't want to try too hard. I just really wanted to come on, bring energy, and try and bring a bit of accuracy and calm. And um, you know, I was hopeful, I was trying to shift momentum back in our favour. And um, but you know, I think the forwards really helped that, being able to go to our set piece build pressure through that um, and yeah, do enough to win and that was the key tonight. We weren't going to be able to blow them away. We had to find a way to win and get in front and um, we didn't make it easy but it was something, that'll be a game I'll never forget and sometimes winning like that is, is a lot more special than a, than a different kind of win. Aaron, the team on track going into the World Cup, they, where you guys want to be this time of the year, 80 minutes away from this time of tour? Well, if you think six weeks ago we were starting a new campaign and they said to you, you win four out of four and keep the blitters low when they rate the championship and be very happy. Um, I think it's a time to reflect. Tonight's about celebrating as a team the new debutants that have joined our club. Um, all our families are here. Tonight's about celebrating this chunk of the year. Um, you know, that was actually a really awesome one to be a part of. And, um, it might keep the media a bit quiet if we lost that one. They would have thrown a whole spanner in the works. But um, you know, massively proud of the efforts, and I thought the new boys really added something tonight. You keep talking about the new boys. If you start with seven penny and I'm sure like, you know, that's good for us. Yeah, and uh, unreal. And it's, I'm, I'm really happy for them. And well, that's the beauty of our yeah, squad. Is, you know, the next man up has to do a job. And, um, it was, a, it was an amazing rugby championship, um, a special one, and special for our team. We were looking to make changes from last year, and um, we have taken some positive steps. But we're definitely not a finished product, and um, I think we're all waiting for Monday night now.